need a way to organize our paints. So what we're going to need for that is we're going to need one of the towel holders, paper towel holders from the Dollar Tree. And then we are going to need four of the napkin holders from the Dollar Tree. You're also going to need two, four, six, eight, 12, 14 zip ties. Or if you want to use, um, help me out, pipe cleaners. If you want to use pipe cleaners, you could use pipe cleaners. That would work just the same. I chose zip ties. So the first thing you're going to do is take two of your napkin holders and you are going to zip tie them together right, right here. We're just going to loop a zip tie right through one side and another one over here in the other corner. So let me see if I could do that first and then lift it up to show you guys. Um, this is a lot easier to do in person than it is to really explain where to put the zip ties or pipe cleaners through exactly, but you'll get, you'll get a feel for it. So right there, I have my one zip tie. Now I'm going to take another one, put it through the other side. Pull it as tight as you can pull it because that will keep the, the shape steady. So here we go. We have our two napkin holder zip tied together. Now, I already attached two of them to save us time. What you're going to do is we'll start with the bottom and you're just going to attach the two Uh, that you already zip tied together to the center paper towel holder. Oh, I'm trying to leave it at an angle so you guys could see, but it's really hard to pull the zip ties like that. So okay. I'm gonna take another zip tie. Attach it the other end to the bottom. And by the time you have to do the top, it's a lot easier, trust me. Dollar Tree does have zip ties. I grabbed these from my husband's stash downstairs. Okay. So now we have, and yes, it's going to move up and down until we secure the top. So now we have those two secured at the bottom. And all we're going to do is just bend it until it meets right here. And we are going to zip tie two more times up at the top. Again, you're going to be going to be a lot easier for you to do it on your own. It's really hard for me to show you exactly where I'm zip tying them, but I don't know. I didn't eat my Wheaties this morning. I'm pretty weak. I don't know what's going on. And maybe you want to use pipe cleaners. Maybe pipe cleaners would be easier than zip ties. That is possible. Okay, and I'm going to attach the last one right up top. These are like the hardest zip ties I've ever worked with. 
But again, maybe that's good. Maybe they'll be nice and strong. Okay, now I'm gonna cut off all my crazy ends that are sticking out here as close as I can. And I mean, this is for your own use at home, so if it's not perfect, that's okay. Um, it's not like we're crafting this to give it as a gift. This is just to help us organize our own craft area and our own paints. And again, if you use pipe cleaners, then you're not gonna have to cut off the ends. You can just keep wrapping them around. So that that might be that might be the way you want to go. But I'm digging this. I am digging this. Now, I did find two little black zip ties that my husband had downstairs. So what we're gonna do is put them up top. Oh, these ones are much easier to work with, the little baby zip ties. And let's see if I go this direction. No, this direction, no. Okay, well, we'll see. I'm gonna put another, and again, you, oh, there we go, we did it right. You can use pipe cleaners up top. But, and then I think, I don't have my hot glue gun plugged in and you can't see it too good. Um, well, here, you can't see it too good, but if you see this, our little butterfly paint holder now has two little antennas right there. How sweet is that? Then you're just gonna take your paint and you are going to put your paint right in here. You can um, put as, well, let's see, I don't know how many it'll hold. One, two, three, four, five, six, so six, 12. Probably hold about 24 of the little guys. And you can even actually put some paint in the middle if you want. So if it, if it holds six, 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 six of the little guys, Looks like it'll hold another maybe four of the um, four in the middle on each side, another eight. So I'm loving this. So now not only do we have our brushes organized, but we have, and I only had it sitting on this towel because I didn't want it to scratch my counter. So here you go. So now you can see it a little bit better and we're gonna have our paint organized, our brushes organized, and this cost us all of $4 to make from, no, excuse me, $5 to make four of the napkin holders and one of the paper towel holders. $5 to make from the Dollar Tree and you've got your own paint holder, paint organizer. You can carry it with you if you move from room to room, what have you, but I am actually thinking this is adorable. And I am gonna hot glue his little antennas straight so that they stand up when uh, when I'm done with the video. So hope you enjoy it, hope you're able to try it on your own, and uh, thank you so much for continuing to sprinkle Gnome and Backyard. Have a great day.